I love Philadelphia. I get, I get lots of love in Philly. I'm used to it now. I mean, it's always great, a great feeling. I mean, like, the, the, the little kid from Philadelphia got people coming up and wanting to take pictures. Like, that's crazy. Sometimes I surprise myself, but I'm kind of used to it now. But, I mean, it's always love and fun, for sure. One, one, two, three. Ah. Body head. Ah. Woo. Roll. Ah. Woo. Turn. Ah. Woo. Roll. Ah. One, one, two, three again. Ah. I can't not be the best. I always strive for the best. It's something that was in me. And I have, I, I, I got so many trophies to, to prove it. In every sport I ever did, I was just good at it. I cannot not be the best. <laughs> when I went to belt, Devontae Davis will have to go through me to get the belt back. And he says he wants an IBF strap back. And I mean, he can get it back if the price is right. This is the real Tevin Foreman right here. This is the real Dustin Poirier. This is the real Michael Chandler. This is the real. James, the Beast Wilson. Everyone has a story. But this is mine. This one's mine. This one is mine. Body head. Roll. Turn. Top a big nigga down just like a tree. Let's go to work. These suckers are screwed, all of them. <laughs> if y'all want those problems, if y'all want that smoke. My name is Tevin Farmer. I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I'm a professional fighter and I fight at 130 pounds. Drop your shoulder back with your back feet. Drop your shoulder back right there, your back feet up the center. There you go. What I like about boxing is, boxing teach you discipline, self-discipline. You gotta be very disciplined to, to be able to box. And that's something boxing taught me, how to be disciplined in and out of the ring. And I think that's why I'm so good at it. Good shot. I was working at Rite Aid when I was like 16 up until like 19 when I started boxing. That's when I stopped and just, I dedicated everything to boxing. Let's work on that, right? Right there. Uh -uh. Right there. Yeah, Papito, right there. There you go, turn it. Yeah, pa, that's a beautiful shot. I thought I was taking boxing serious at the time. But then I took a couple losses, and once I got with my new team, I realized I really wasn't taking it as serious. Because I had just gotten into it, so I didn't know what taking it serious was. We don't want these fucking referees to try to take the point or fuck up, especially on the world title. So when you're going to be hit, you drop real comfortable, lock in, give it to me up there, and then you turn up and top. Only a 16 amateur fight. Um, I went pro at 19. Well, I started boxing at 19. I really didn't take it serious. And I didn't know about like going to the Nationals and all that stuff like that. I just thought that boxing was easy. And I knew I had talent. And when I went pro, I seen that I like, all right, maybe I should have stayed amateur long. That's when I started to learn about boxing. I wasn't born into boxing. So most kids start at eight, nine, even younger. I started at 19, so I, I knew nothing about it. I was, I'm still learning on the job. Drive, drive, drive. Get that ass down. There you go. I work so hard for multiple reasons. Of course, we all wanna get money and move our families and have a good life. But I also work hard because it's something that I just do. I mean, I wanna be the best at everything. Slam the shit out of it. Come on, slam that. There you go. Tom, clap him. I can't not be the best. I always strive for the best. It's something that was in me. And I have, I, I, I got so many trophies to, to prove it. In every sport I ever did, I was just good at it. I can't not, not be the best. Stand all the way up when you get up there. Get it. Yeah, yeah, push. Drive, drive, drive. Dig. Come on, Tav, come on, come on. Good shit, baby. I was always a motivated guy. I was always a motivated guy. My biggest motivation, uh, I just wanted to, see my family succeed and, and be the best that they can be. It's not so much about me, it's more about them. When I win, we all win.
I'm definitely a positive guy. And my and my my positive attitude and positive mindset, it comes from me. I mean, even everyone I'm around, everyone I'm around is positive. My mom positive, brother's positive, sister's positive, trainers positive, friends positive. You you are who you hang around, and I hang around with positive people. Okay. Life changing every day, it's time to move my moms. Okay. Moving to Jersey from just spitting rhymes. What? I ain't spitting rhymes. No. I be fighting niggas. Okay. Trying to get this paper, no, I ain't fighting niggas. Damn. I got some goon niggas, they be slicing niggas. What? Fly kicking nigga, he like bison nigga. Oh. You wanna war with me? Okay. You can war with him, man, he's a G. Oh. All my niggas say I'm buzzing, you can treat me like B. Okay. Now I chop a big nigga down okay. just like a tree. Slice. Chainsaw, his oh. neck off, blow it back out. Oh. Hey, boy, this is a dice game, you done crapped out. Oh. I used to shoot oh. dice since I was 14. Okay. Since a young boy, I had big dreams. Ah, I seen have. niggas die, I seen mamas cry. Okay. The tougher niggas die, you be singing a lot of vibes. Oh. And when you playing with ya, okay. I walk up with a nigga, I'm going to hit ya. Sitting with the Hook and leave me stiff up. Yeah, I always tell my family, we, we, we chill, laugh, play, and we all know we like to rap. We like to play around and rap. You know, I got bars. I think I would have probably, probably would have been a rapper if I wasn't a boxer. They can go anywhere in North and get love, because they love it, because they know we Look, 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 real yeah. shit. Yeah, we we on camera, she talking about Reese, do you got some? Tell me, this shit is real out here. I love Philadelphia. I get, I get lots of love in Philly. I never had. I never had no drama or beef with nobody, ever, like in Philadelphia. And I can go to any hood and be cool. I'm good. Shout out to everybody in Philly, South Philly, North Philly, Philly, Philly Southwest, West Philly, Frankfurt, Uptown, Oh yeah, salute downtown, my city. Everybody. I love my city. I don't give a fuck, my city is where it started from. We love our city. We back in TF, y'all know the rest, y'all you know I mean? And we doing this shit. <laughs> Having the belt is my dream because I know when you got the belt, you consider one of the best in the world. When I get my belt, I will be considered one of the best in, in the world. When this belt definitely will change my life. When this belt changed my life a thousand percent, a thousand percent. It's already changing my life in multiple ways. Your heart have not been tested yet. My heart haven't tested? Never. My heart haven't been tested. Never. I've been, te I've been testing more than you. A belt don't make a champion. A belt don't make a champion. A belt don't, listen. The beef with me and David is really not a beef to me. Um, it's more so like a for me, it for me is a he a young guy coming up from Baltimore. I'm a young guy coming up from Philadelphia. So and we in the same division, it's more like a for me it's more like a um it's like a strong competitive thing. I mean, for him it may be for him it may be a beef. Or to the fans it may look like a beef. But for me it's more 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 competitive and I know like he think he the best, I think I'm the best. And we and, and, and we gotta prove it. We gotta prove it one day. When I win the belt, Javante Davis will have to go through me to get the belt back. And he says he wants his IBF strap back. And I mean, he can get it back if the price is right. But if not, he he have to wait his time. He they was doing the same thing with me. It was making me wait, making me wait, making me wait. And he he slipped up, didn't make weight, lost the belt. Now I'm fighting for it. So I mean. He can get it back if the price right. Or he got to just wait to be a mandatory to get this work. But he's gonna get it one way or the other. It's gonna happen. I know that for a fact. <laughs>